hey guys welcome back to my channel as you can see i have food right here because we're doing a mukbang so i got some wing stuff and i made me some uh chicken alfredo pasta i don't know i was just craving it really really bad i'm so thirsty mm. that's so good so i've noticed that y'all love story times and i love them too so um Oh, let me show you what I ordered. I didn't even bring on. Oh, yeah, I did. So, what I got is some Cajun, bonus Cajun wings. So good. And then, obviously, my fries. I love these fries. They're so bomb. So bomb. And then, I brought me my chicken Alfredo sauce. I mean, it doesn't even have chicken because chicken Why? And then, I'm going to add this, like, chile that my dad makes it's just crushed chiles and he just like mixes them together and it's so good with soups and pasta so that's why i got me the chile in the pasta and then some cheese i never eat it with cheese but i'm gonna try it but let's eat now i'm gonna try a wing i cannot see all that far so i don't even know if it looks good okay it mm. mm -hmm. that's so good mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's so good guys all right i'll start with the story time in a minute just wait now i'm gonna try the fettle sauce and i'm definitely gonna put some chili my stomach is gonna be a fire, bitch. With my other mukbangs, y'all were like, oh my god, you talk so much, eat. So, like, what the fuck are coming for me? I'm gonna just put some. I'm telling you, this shit is good. I don't know how to eat this, but. Mmm. Mm hmm. That is. Mm hmm. If my lipstick is like all over the place, I apologize. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I don't know why it's gonna hurt so bad. Let's start with the story time because I know you're like, it's like, what the fuck? Like, what does that title mean? I've never mentioned it or talked about it. But today, I am, bitch. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this story was my... It was for sure my sophomore year because of my junior year I already met my boyfriend and that happened before I knew my boyfriend. So it was my sophomore year of high school. And by this time I've already started social media, I already started YouTube, Instagram, like I already started, you know? So in high school, I never had beef with anybody, uh, and if I did, it was one side beef. Like I, like I honestly didn't care about drama, or was included in drama because I always tried to not get involved. If that makes sense. If the people I guess knew me was because I was on YouTube, but that was really it. Cause I never even talked to people. I was really bad at making new friends at making conversations. The only two friends I have were since I met them in 6th grade. So I'm telling you, like, it, I never really made, like, new friendships. So 
So by this time, I was getting more followers. More people were texting me, DM me, like, um, oh, I watch on YouTube and here and that. So I used to reply to them, you know, um, and I still try to reply, reply to my DMs. So like I said, I was getting more followers. So when you get more followers, people do tend to like DM you more. And it was like, sometimes you don't even know what they texted you because they like, they get lost, you know, the, the DMs get lost. So I remember one night I was checking my Instagram and as normal, I go to my DMs. I get so distracted. Like I said, I checked my DMs. Like it was like a normal ass day. I checked my DMs, and then tell me why I go and it was this random ass account. Like it had not even like you know the accounts that have like oh like just like letters. I clicked on it and it. Let me tell you what the DM said. The DM said, "I'm going to kill you in the restroom," and I was like, "Who the fuck up? What restroom?" Because. I was confused as in like, oh, it's pro it's a joke or like, but when I read that, honestly, I got, I got a little shaky because like, who the fuck says that? Like, who DMs you that? And like, oh, I'm going to do it in the restroom. Like, so it's specific. And I was like, my, my, my house restroom? When I go to the store restroom? Or like, what the, f like, I was confused, you know, I did not get it. And I am kind of slow, so you have to explain things to me like really good, like, you know? So I was like, mmm. Mm, like in my mind I was like a random ass account just said that it's just it's like fake you know it's fake so um obviously I click on the on the username and I see that he has followers and then you know how Instagram let me show you if I, if so I can see when you click on an account on Instagram you can see who follows the account it says it's just like basically mutuals. I think that's what I'm, I don't even know what that word means. I don't even know what I'm saying yet. But it goes what I'm saying. So I don't know if you can see, but it says followed by. And it's people that you follow, follow the account. Okay. So the people that says followed by. Okay, look. I'm just trying. I don't know if I can focus. It's just, I'm thinking I'm just too far away. I see that and it's two people that follow the account. And those two people go to school with me, so it it, it 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 just clicks, and I'm just like, wait, he means or she means the restroom in my school, and I'm just like, hold up, and then I keep looking, and I'm like, I know these people, like I know the people that follow the account. One of them was a girl, one of them were a boy. Honestly, for a who the boy was, cause it you know like it doesn't really say in your mind, but the girl I remember who she was, she was my best friend from a long time ago like long time ago and she was in my grade the boy i think i believe because i don't remember his account but i believe he was a grade lower than me wait no a grade above me because i was a sophomore you know so above me so i'm just like i know them and i knew the people i remember knowing the boy also i know the girl because she was my best friend so I'm going to eat again. Oh, can you make sure the cap, like, you can mm. see? It smells delicioso. Oh, bitch, why do you move it? I didn't. Okay, go put it. I'm trying to check if everything's okay. You got warranty, right? I guess I know, like, my camera is tripping and I'm, like, I'm going to beat that bitch up right now. But I'm going to keep doing with this story. It's like, hold the fuck up. So that means, like, He's going to try to murder me in the restroom. And um, honestly, I didn't tell nobody. I think I only told my two friends and that was really it. But I didn't tell my parents or not, nobody because I was like, they can't do anything. And my school principal doesn't really give, doesn't give a fuck at all. Like my school, bruh. Uh, no, like they're just like, oh, they DM'd you? Ha! <laughs> like, good luck. So I like, what was the point of telling them?
Mm. And I was a type to always be in the restroom. Like, the restroom was like my second home, okay? Mmm. Especially because, um, I had no friends in lunch. Instead of being in lunch, I just used to be in the restroom. So I was like, oh my god, they probably see me in the restroom all the time. So that's why they're trying to murder me right there. Uh, <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I was going to say something, but I forgot. Um... Oh yeah, I was trying to look for the DM to show y'all that I'm not lying. But I cannot find it. Like I said, this was my junior year. I'm now, I now graduated. So it's so hard to find it. And there's probably a chance that they already deleted it. But I did send it to my friends. And now that I'm thinking about it, I can just find it there. Wait, let me see. Mm-hmm. But we take so much. And I think I did delete it. Because, you know, I used what's up with my friends. Hold the fuck up. But I don't remember what we said. Which is the I'm honestly I don't think I have the picture anymore. But I really should have had it for evidence. But I remember I did kept it in my DMs because I could have even deleted it. But I kept it just in case it does happen. The police could search my phone and be like, oh, this motherfucking killed her and arrest this motherfucking ass. But yeah, like I said, I don't know what the fuck was going through my mind that I didn't tell nobody like which now that I watch murder cases and I'm educated about it. If Bailey Sarah would have been like, oh, it was this like 16 year old girl who got a DM from Instagram and the DM said that they wanted to kill her in the restroom of the school, but she ignored it. I would have been like, this dumbass bitch ignored the DM. With and that bitch ignored it, I would have beat that bitch up. Like, that's so dumb. But that's me, you know? That's like telling her that it wasn't gonna happen. But I don't know what really was going through my mind that I didn't do nothing about it. I just. I was like, I fight bad bitch, even though I don't. So much shit happened in my high school years. And this is like the first time that I talk about this story. really got any weird vibes in the restaurant until one time I was I just went to the restroom like I said because I always go to the restroom and it was a restroom that's like a little bit more hidden oh I'm so sorry guys my camera fucking died literally I'm in the middle of fucking talking and my camera dies and I'm just like I don't know if this is a sign because so much shit keeps going on to not say this story but I'm like it's my story so I can say it Mm, 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 so I remember I went to the restroom, like I said, that restroom was really like hidden. Not hidden, but not a, lot of, not a lot of people went there. I was done using the restroom. I washed my hands. And when I was in the restroom, I do remember somebody was in the other stall. There were only two of them. And I do hear a girl crying. Like, crying. And I was like, is this a murder? Is this a person who's going to kill me? So, um, I remember hear her, hearing her crying, and I was like, should I just run away, or should I ask, right, or ask, and I was like, I should ask, and then I was like, is everything okay, and she was like, yeah, everything's okay, she starts telling me, I, for, I think I, I think this, or I did mention it on my videos, I, re, I forgot which video it was, but I'm pretty sure I mentioned it in one of my videos, I don't I'm trying to remember everything because back then I remember it. But basically, she had kicked out from her school, like suspended from my school. And basically, she was not supposed to be there. And she came back 
I forgot why she came back, but she was not supposed to be there. And I was like, oh, okay, you're not supposed to be here. I was like, why are you back in school? Like, you know, and I don't remember if I, she mentioned the reason. I did remember saying this story on YouTube and I don't remember if she told me why she was, but I do remember her telling me that she was in the restroom hiding because she didn't want the she didn't want to get caught basically so i was like red flag red flag red flag but you know i cannot read a red flag because i'm a dumb 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 bitch no sir 